What's going on, everybody? Ed Zoller, Villa Realty Group, Lot Doctors, Teachers Can Buy Homes, EdZoller.com. I am making websites galore this month, so I'm going to put a bunch of links to the things that I have going on right now. I'm doing the winner reveal, though, of the trivia. That's the point of today's video, and I don't think I stumped any one of you. I don't even think... A other than a couple people out of 50 guessed wrong. Uh, I think you guys all knew this one back in 2019. My favorite candy, and that's the little sweethearts uh, with the little sayings on them, uh, all got, uh, they, they were out of business. They went out of business and a new company took over. So in 2019, there were none on the shelves. I ended up getting two bags for this Valentine's Day. So thanks everyone for answering. Do know that if you don't get it right, it's okay. You're still in the running. I'm still going to put you in the rotation, put you on the Plinko board. Uh, so I'm going to put some links of some new websites that I have going on. I want to share a couple things with you about what's going on. A lot of you guys are curious about the market, talking about refis and everything else. And I want to give you some of the tools that I use on a daily basis. And uh, this might help answer some of those questions. So I'm going to phone real quick and show you very, very first one. That's my new logo, the E and Z. If you can see that, it's an E and a Z for Ed Zoller. Um, what your home may be worth and what, how much more it could be worth than that. Uh, right now, it's under marketvalue.edzoller.com. I'm going to have a link in the email of that one. Um, please help me try this new software out. You put in your address. Uh, it'll find your house for you. And uh, within minutes, it'll let me know uh, that I, I need to do some work <laughs> for you. Um, but that's the new one. Uh, a couple of things people are asking about interest rates. I use mortgagenewsdaily.com. And if you click on the 30-year fixed rate, it will show you what the true rate is. Don't just go on Google. Don't listen to the news. You don't know what they're quoting. You can go under 15-year fix, 30-year FHA, 30-year jumbo, 5-1 arm. So right now, if I did under 30-year uh, on FHA, you can tell that there was a time that it was at where it's at right now, which is about March of 2020, right before COVID. And as you can tell here, interest rates have gone back up. On the 30-year conventional, you can see a huge increase over the last, I don't know, since December 2021. It's above 4%. A little bit of dip today. Uh, you can also take a look at the 10-year treasury note. If you have a Yahoo Finance and want to pretend that you bought one, you can look to see what happens there. Sure enough, the 10-year note crashed, to, uh, went down today, would say it crashed uh, on the 16th, and interest rates followed suit with that little bit of dip. But as you can tell, interest rates are pretty high. Uh, what does all this mean? You guys own houses that are watching this, and does this mean that you need a refinance? No, what you're going to notice that is a lot of agents are going to be blindly mailing you because there's really nothing for sale right now. People aren't selling because there's really no place to buy. Uh, so it's kind of a double-edged sword. You want a place that new place to buy, upgrade your house. Uh, you need to sell your house, but then you're going to be homeless <laughs> because you're not going to be able to find a house because no one else is selling. Um, so that's kind of what this year has brought. Uh, we have very little for sale. Back going to a stat long time ago, uh, for instance, Cape Coral was founded in the 60s. There was more houses in the early 70s for sale in Cape Coral than there are today, even though our population is 10 times what it was back then. Uh, so just kind of put that in perspective. Um, people are going to want you to refinance lenders. The Mortgage Broker Association said that applications are way down. So they're going to be calling you and mailing you and telling you all about the bad PMI just to create some more business. Uh, and so just be wary of anyone who wants you to do something. They may not be looking out for your best interest. Know that I, doing these videos every single month and doing my little trivias, and all that, I want to stay in contact with you. You know that I always am going to have your best interest. I just convinced four people in a row they don't want to sell their house right now. Uh, because the, of their situation. Uh, a lot of buyers, I'm kind of not steering towards that, but just saying, you know, this is the kind of the worst time to buy a house. Interest rates are high. Insurance is temporarily high. There's nothing for sale. And the things that you're picking from are, there's not a lot to pick from. So I think buyers still need to be pickier, uh, just as picky as when you guys bought your home. And I kind of told you the same thing. So nothing's really changed in my aspect other than I don't really have a lot of houses to sell. Uh, so I'm getting into some other uh, avenues, you know, started up Lot Doctors. I'm going to put a link down below so you can see a look at that. Um, trying to find lots for my clients who have houses that have lots nearby them. Um, I'm doing uh, mailers and postcards every month. Uh, but anyway, enough about me. I'll have all this in the links below. You guys are here to find out who won. So let's 
go to the Plinko board. And thank you for bringing it this far. Jennifer Compatelli, she was here last month. Uh, Andrea Justice, Tori Stryker, and Chris Vazola. You guys are on the Plinko board. I'm just going to put it right on the middle, right at the top. Let it crash around. Wait, I'm going to drop it. Let's see if I can make it this. Okay, I think I'm just going to place this nicely and let it fall where it may. Andrea Justice, you are February's Amazon gift card winner. Thanks for doing the trivia questions. I think you have done it every single month. This is the first time I think you're winning. So just so it goes to show you guys, keep going. Uh, keep answering them. Uh, first Monday of every month. If you miss it, I wait a week. So just because you felt like it was too late, it wasn't. Um, I, I wait an entire week to get everyone in. I get a lot of stuff on Fridays, even though it goes out Monday. Uh, so that's why I waited till this week to reveal a winner video. Uh, check the links down below in the email I'm sending you. If you guys have any interest in looking at that, uh, if you want to be my first guinea pig or test the market value of your home, uh, it should be a fairly fast software thing I just invested in. Uh, and you should be able to put your money in. Uh, you put your, you, I just want to make sure it all works. So I've tested it a couple of times myself. But I'd love you guys, if you guys are interested in what knowing what your number is and what your house is worth, uh, to go on that site and uh, put your information in. It just goes to me, uh, so it's my site. Um, but uh, anyway, thank you all for watching, and I uh, appreciate all you guys doing what you're doing. If you felt like you missed the trivia contest, first Monday of every month, it goes out in the morning. I wait the entire week. Be on the lookout for it. It always hits every single month. Um, and uh, next month will is my birthday and Hannah's birthday, so my daughter's. So we'll probably have something special for that. Anyway, talk to you later, Scott. Talk to you later, and uh, look forward to chatting with you soon. Bye bye.